Hi everybody, my name is Jilly, Jilly B Living Her Life Her Way and um, I love post crossing. So I've got a couple of um, postcards I can send. So my printer has run out of ink, so I'm going to have to handwrite addresses this time. But let us get an address first. Let's have a look. Let's see who I'm going to. So this is going to the America and the person's name is Amy. And she likes, oof, what does she like? She's an artist, she likes to draw, she likes to make books, um, hand carved rubber stamps. Uh, what does she like here? I love postcards with information of where you live, pictures of your town or anything interesting, sites, museums, gardens and castles. Postcards with a place you've visited, vacated, vacated, vacationed as in gone on holiday. Um, pictures of art or crafts from your region, uh, nature or wildlife, a postcard that made by you, anything you really want to send. I can read traditional Chinese characters if you write neatly. Wow, you go. Right then, so she likes arts and crafts. I've got a lot of that. Um, I've got some of uh, Durham, so let's find some and I'll come back. Right, I'm back, so let's go. So I've lost her. Hold on, let me just put my password in. So what did I say she liked? Places I've been on holiday, places like town or somewhere close to where I live, arts and crafts. So arts and crafts these are actually items that somebody up here made and it's hidden strengths into cake it's 12 slices of mixed media on wood so it's supposed to look like a, it's a cake looks like a walnut cake doesn't it but inside it's all different things so hidden strengths formed in 1980 is a group of 20 women artists working in west yorkshire so i thought she might like one of them then she likes art, so there's this one. Crafts, so there's some baskets there. Handicrafts. Somewhere close to me uh, is the North Yorkshire Dales. And then not so long ago I went to Durham, so this is very close to where I am. Uh, that's the sanctuary. The sanctuary knocker, so back in the day, if the police were all chasing you, Back in 1140, you would knock on this cathedral door and you were given sanctuary and they'd try and get you out of there. Another postcard, all local. Another local one. And the big clock. A lovely one there, very bright. More. Some Lego. I'll I think I'll keep the Lego for somebody who likes Lego. I may keep the brightly coloured ones for somebody else. Um, Angel of the North, that's on the A1. So if you're going up to Edinburgh, you will pass this just before you get to Gateshead-ish. And I've been there, it's quite nice. It's lovely. It's bigger than you think. <coughs> Durham, England. Like an old advertising style one. Don't think she'd be interested in that or that. That one's quite a nice aerial view, but I'll keep those for somebody who's into aerial views. So I'm back to, to these. And to be fair, I am very, very drawn to this one. Ashley Legs Arts and Crafts. I think I'll go for that one because that's this open, isn't it? So put those to the side. Let me move my laptop. Let me move this out of the way and then we can get cracking, can't we? Okay, so we'll go for this one Hidden Strengths. Made in 1980, and I think it's brilliant. 
each slice of the walnut cake is something very unique. And as this person likes art, um, I think she like this one. And she also has a dog, some Aquarians and some overgrown nature style garden and workaholic husband. Hmm. So let's go for this one. So what do we need first? We need a bit of washi, don't we? So let's see what I've got here. I do like this washi tape shop. Um, foxes. What have we got? How about I quite like this Van Gogh one. So we'll put the Van Gogh on. Now I don't want to take this out of the um because I think she might like to read it, so I'm just gonna put a little bit of washi at the bottom just here scissors so that she can read it because I think she's very arty she might she might appreciate it the um the details a little bit of washi there 1980 so oh that was 40 40 42 years ago, my goodness. Right, let's choose some stamps. I thought, <coughs> excuse me, I thought I'm running out of stamps, but I'm not. I have more, but I need to separate them. So, stamps. So, I think I will put one of these one. Yeah, I was thinking, oh, I haven't got many stamps, but I do have a couple of sheets to um to break up so that they're individual i just haven't done it yet and i was thinking why have i run out of so many stamps hey i don't know so i've got enough room for the address there i'll put the id along here but we need something else don't we what do we need i'm sure i have got some van gogh stickers there we go I think a little Van Gogh sticker to match this. I know it won't leave me much room to write, but that's okay. I might smaller, can't I? Oh wow, that is a bit on the large side, isn't it? Are they all the same? Hmm, I might have to think again here. These are quite large, aren't they? Hmm, let's pull them out to see what we have. What I could do actually is put one there. I'll put one there and that still gives me room for an address and some writing. Right. I love Van Gogh. Uh, absolutely love his work. Right then, let's get this peeled off. We've had a really good bit of weather um, in the UK. When I say good, it's it's as hot as where Lewis lives in Abu Dhabi. And, oh, just too hot. Too hot for me. Uh, it was it was like 38 yesterday. Um, it was way too hot for me anyway. I'm not a worshipper of the sun in any way any means at all so it was quite uncomfortable to be at work and be, you know moving about and things like that it was quite uncomfortable so i'm just looking for something else to stick on this uh, the postcard let me see uh, furry friends oh no she's got a dog hasn't she yeah. i'll know when i see it some nice bird, actually, I might put a couple of bird ones on. She talked about the garden, didn't she? Tell me, when is to enough postcards enough? Because I just seem to have a lot. <laughs> I love having a lot of postcards. I like the choices I can give people. 
I can choose something nice to, to match that person. Oh, they're nice, aren't they? Mm, right. Now I want some of that unmatch. Uh, some little bunches of flowers there. Let's just pop a couple of them around just to break it up a bit. Oh, I shared some smaller Van Gogh. Um, that's pretty stickers, but I don't. But saying that, I'm sure I'll get some now. <laughs> I'll find some somewhere. So that's the first card. As I say, I don't want to over decorate this one because the, because the person's really into her arts and crafts. I thought she might like to read that. Um, so I've kept it a little bit simple, but I've kept space for her information there and her address. So let's put, so I'll put a little message on about the postcard. So I'm just going to highlight the, um, the, um, can't speak the ID so she can see it some new crane colors of course I'm still thinking about them there we go so this area here obviously after the video I will put the address but there is the beautiful stamp, there's a bit of Van Gogh washi and sticker. I love this little sticker here, goes well with the washi doesn't it? And just a little message. So that's the first one. I think that postcard is fabulous. Let me know what you think in the comments guys. Did I pick the right one for somebody who's in art and design? I hope so. I might give us some inspiration for something, I don't know. Right. To the next card right let's see if we can get somebody else's now let's have a look send a postcard right. have a little sip of my drink i had to run and get a drink because i was coughing so who have we got next somebody in the Philippines Leah lady oh my gosh she's got a long profile let me just read mm. here are my wishful thinkings some call them dreams oh she's done about places she wants to be I also enjoy the live stream of her pianists um, Decided to stop my long wish list of postcards as I realised I. So she had a long list, so she stopped the long list of postcards. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. So she said she would like a nice postcard of good quality and of sturdy paper. I would not mind a COVID 19 related card or green flowers either, but no snake pictures, please. Let's see. That's about all she says. Now I'm sure I might have some COVID, um, some COVID postcards and green flowers. Did you say green flowers? What did I say? Let's have a look. I would not mind. Does that mean she wants them or not? I'm just going to have to go on a. Um, I'll just go on a wall and let me see if I'm working this out properly. Because I'm not sure. Let's have a look on a wall, see what she's got. Hmm. I can't see any COVID related or is that just a way? Um, maybe she's just not said it right. I can't see any COVID on her wall, but I'm just going to check the scent. Favourites, sorry. My goodness, let's have a look. Oh no, she does have some COVID related ones on her favourite wall. Hmm, so maybe she what does want COVID ones. I didn't quite understand the message. It was just, 
obviously English is not this lady's first language, but I'm telling you now, she she's she's got a good language. But the mine. Right, one second, I'm just gonna have to shut the door. Somebody's shouting outside. So the neighbours were talking to each other, but loudly. So I didn't think you'd want to hear that. So let me get to my COVID. I think we'll send a COVID one because that's what she's um she's asked for. And I do have COVID ones somewhere. Let's have a look. Um hmm. where are they? I do have some. Right, so I found some um, COVID cards. These are my last ones. So these are Royal Mail um, release. So we've got doctors and nurses for the COVID. We've got the um, lab technician. These worked very hard throughout COVID, didn't they? We've got a nurse and it's somebody's mum as well. And then I've got this one, which I haven't sent this one before. I've got two of these and it's COVID-19. And this is what people had to dress like back then. Um, you know, it was very serious, wasn't it? So I don't know whether to send that one or one of these. Mm. I quite like all of them. Um, I think I'll send that one because that one strikes you as COVID. And this lady's from the Philippines, so it might be more recognisable. I don't know. So... This is the one we're going to go with. So I'll move my laptop out of the way and then we'll find some nice washi tape and get cracking. Right then. What shall we have? First, we need a nice stamp, don't we? Let's have a look. Um, let's get the stamps. Oh, now I do have some cold stamps left here. So... Mm. Or maybe, maybe a couple of C ones. That might be quite nice, might not it? I needed to put a airmail sticker on that other postcard. Now I forgot to do it. Mm. Where's that going to go now? Ah. Stick it there. To put it there. <laughs> Right, so let's not forget this time to put the, the sticker on, the airmail sticker. Eee, I've been trying to do this video and I've, I, I just seem to have got nowhere. I don't know why. I think I've been a bit distracted today. Um, just busy, work, you know. I got away early today though, which was nice. Because working in that heat yesterday was awful. Right, so there's the stamps and there's the airmail sticker so we don't forget. Now then, shall we find some nice washi tape? Let's have a look. I need a new tub for my washi. washi. I can't close the lid now. You'll see what I mean when I open it. <laughs> How much is too much? So, let's find some nice washi. That's a lovely one, isn't it? Now, this card is black and white. So, I think a little bit of colour wouldn't go far, would it? Let's see. That one's quite nice. Oh, no, it's not colour, but I quite like that one. Uh, look. I could go a bit... A bit different, couldn't I? I just call for something totally different. Shall I do it? Yes. Let's be spontaneous. My goodness. See, I can't close it. So I may have to invest in something better. I did see some tubs on Amazon where you can just lay them side by side like that, but I don't know. Right, let's get some washi on, shall we? Hmm. Yeah, I like that one. And with the card being in black and white, I think that goes quite well. My snazzy pen's trying to roll off the uh, desk. Oh, it stopped now. 
I bought this pen the other day. It's got a little little llama's head on it. See that? And it says, no problema. <laughs> and I like the colours very much. So because I'm going to go a bit crazy today, I'm going to put pink on just to give it a splash of colour. Now, I'll, when I can get in it. That's strange, isn't it? Oh, there it is. Yeah, there we go. I think that looks quite nice. A bit of glamour, a bit of sparkle. Right. Put a bit down the side for the address. There we go. Is that right? Oh no, I thought it was a hair or something. It's just a mark on the postcard. The swashy doesn't want to play nice. Right. There we go. That's perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, so now we need the ID. Which I'll write the ID down and put that up here. Mm. Oh, nearly run out of room. And it's the 20th of July. Right, I think we need we need some stickers, don't we? No, I, don't, I know for a fact I don't have COVID stickers. I, I don't know, we'll probably buy COVID stickers. But I do have lots of nice stickers. So let's get looking. Now I quite like them ones. Just a bit different. Hmm. Let's have a look. No. Let's see. These are Emma Ball stickers. I did a little haul with her last year. She does all sorts of different things. And I was really impressed with the quality. Some little banners. They're quite nice, aren't they? Some pretty flowers. I'm just pulling a few out and then I'll I'll go from there. Santa. I don't need Santa yet, do we guys? Unicorns. What are those? Oh, autumn. Cats. Do you know what? Oh, llamas. I forget what I've got. Right then. Do you think I've chosen enough? Oh, I might put one of them on. It's a nice sunny day, so we're going to put a nice sunny sun on it. There go. So it's pinks and blacks, isn't it? So, hmm. quite like that one. I think I'm going to use up a lot of room again with the sticker. Should I put in there? Yeah, put in there. It's quite nice, isn't it? And then we'll put, um, mm, what about a little cactus? There we go. I think that's enough for stickers. We're going a bit crazy with the stickers. Right, let me get this lady's name because I've forgotten it and then we'll talk. So, I've done my little message. We're all decorated. We've got some beautiful stamps. 
got a little llama, a little message, the ID and the COVID postcard. So I'm just going to highlight the ID. There's a little bit of blue and yellow. There we go. So guys, that's my post crossing postcards ready to go out. One is going to... Where's she going to? I've forgotten. Do you know this laptop? It just times out so fast. I wonder if I could change that in the settings. Does anybody know that? It's a MacBook. Philippines. So this one's going to the Philippines. And the other one is going to America. So, um, yeah, I don't know where I've put it, but hey ho, never mind, I'll find it again in a minute. <laughs> I'm having one of them days, aren't I? So, thank you so much for watching. Um, thank you for sticking with this uh, video. If you did like this video and like to see more like this, please leave me a thumbs up and subscribe so that you don't miss out on any more videos. Okay, guys, till the next time. Bye bye now.